Oh, hi! Didn't expect to see you in the bathroom. Hi, kids. Welcome. Of course, I guess you never expected to see church in the bathroom either, did you? <laughs> but I had to come here because this is where I keep the bandages. When I hurt myself, I have to come here and get a bandage, and I cut myself. So I gotta come here and get a bandage. You know, when you hurt yourself, you go to your mom or your dad, and you say, ah, I have an owie. And the first thing they do is they say, oh, show me where it hurts. And then they look at it, and maybe they have to clean it off a little, and maybe they put a bandage on it, but then you know what they do. They kiss it, and they make it better. They hold you, and it makes it better. The thing is, it still might hurt, but at least it feels better. God is like that. God cares when we're hurt. And God says, oh, show me where it hurts. Let me see your owie. And God holds us and kisses us and makes it better. It might still hurt, but at least it's better. We're going to hear a Bible story today about somebody who said to Jesus, oh, show me your owie. Because that's what Jesus taught people to do. To care about when people are hurt and we hold each other even if it doesn't necessarily make the pain go away it makes it better I'm glad that God cares about us when we're hurt he doesn't expect us to always be happy and nice sometimes that's what prayer is when we just come to God and say God I hurt and God just holds us and even though the pain is still there makes it better. So I think we should say a prayer and thank God, shall we? Let's pray, God, thank you for holding us when we hurt. Let's pray. God, thank you for holding us when we hurt. Amen. Thank you for being with me when I hurt.